we could talk this all night long. Uh, here's a One great shot <laughs> from the Albagordo Sunset. Isn't that beautiful? Uploaded to our KOAT page at uh, the U Local section. Uh, 63 degrees. We topped off at 64, but it was the coldest morning so far where we start off at like uh, 34 degrees. Now, for your evening, we'll get into that cool to chilly air mass. So, we're getting one of these trends where it's be cold in the morning and uh, delightful in the afternoon. Now, even though the valley locations will be in the freeze, you're not going to get a freeze warning issue because the growing season is over, but it will be ending tonight around uh, Santa Rosa and the Tucumcari area. So, uh, go ahead and make the necessary precautions with the plants and pets. This low will slowly crawl to the east, still kick a few clouds throughout southern portions of New Mexico. You can see this is 7 o'clock in the morning, cold and sunny everywhere else, but some clouds and lingering showers throughout the day. You see the daytime highs starting to edge back above average, and then the cloud cover that you see here on Thursday will uh, give way to a good amount of sunshine on Friday, so you're looking forward to that. Friday looks to be the warmest day of the next few. Then check this out. We have a front that drops on down eastern parts of the state, so back into the 50s and 60s. Some of that will back into Santa Fe and Albuquerque. It will be a one-day event because then we're going to be dropping into uh, bouncing back above average as we get into at least Sunday on into early next week. All right, as we look at uh, Roswell, Artesian, Carlsbad, we talked about the cloud cover, a couple of showers around before it dries out the following day, but sunshine will be in abundance from Socorro down into Silver City and Deming, highs warming into the 60s. Northwestern parts of the state, you see the, the overnight lows will be very frigid and then above normal temperatures in the afternoon. The same will hold true around Santa Fe, Los Alamos, on into Taos with highs in the 50s and 60s. So definitely dress in the layers because we have those cold starts, but you can just Def drop some layers in the afternoon as we warm back to above average temperature. And tonight, again, valley locations will be dropping into the hard freeze area. 29 degrees in Los Lunas and Berlin, but uh, 39 to 37, to 33 to 37. That should be 37. That should be 29 in the uh, heights and the valley for tonight. As we look at the next seven days, there's a cold morning. There's a mild afternoon. Then Friday night and Saturday, some canyon breezes will work in, okay? That will lower temperatures briefly. It gets milder on Sunday. And then from Tuesday into Wednesday, another shot of cool air will be working in. And that looks to be a stronger front, especially over eastern parts of New Mexico. So as we uh, go ahead and check out traffic watch.